Imagine a universe where unseen forces secretly shape everything. The nature of dark matter remains a profound mystery. Unlike ordinary matter, dark matter doesn't interact with light or other forms of electromagnetic radiation, rendering it invisible to traditional telescopes. We're going back to the universe's baby years, just after the Big Bang to unravel a huge cosmic puzzle. If regular matter stops sticking together so soon, then what made all the stars and galaxies that we see today? This video dives into dark matter, a hidden riddle that doesn't play by normal rules. In the immediate aftermath of the Big Bang, the universe was intensely hot and dense, with temperatures reaching billions of degrees Kelvin. Under these extreme conditions, particles such as protons and neutrons existed in a state of thermal equilibrium. As the universe expanded and cooled, Protons and neutrons began to combine through nuclear reactions, facilitated by the strong nuclear force responsible for binding atomic nuclei. This led to the formation of light nuclei, including deuterium, a hydrogen isotope composed of one proton and one neutron, helium-4, helium-3, and trace amounts of lithium and beryllium. However, this nucleosynthesis period was brief, lasting only a few minutes. So how did the universe as we perceive it come to be? The answer seems to lie in the elusive dark matter, a substance that doesn't interact with any protons, neutrons, or other particles via electromagnetic or nuclear forces. Instead, its influence is exerted through gravity, distinguishing it from ordinary matter and classifying it as potential weakly interacting massive particles, WIMPs, or axions. But if it's invisible, then how do we come to know about the existence of this dark matter? Well, scientists identified the discrepancy in calculations concerning the universe's origins, pointing to an unseen but substantial influence, likely facilitating the fusion of hydrogen atoms to create the visible universe. Incorporating dark matter into these calculations began to resolve the inconsistencies. It's believed that around 20 minutes post Big Bang, Particles had dispersed to the point that further fusion of hydrogen atoms halted. This cessation should have prevented the creation of elements necessary for forming stars, galaxies, and planets. But dark matter's gravitational pull drew hydrogen atoms together, enabling further fusion and sparking the nuclear reactions that led to our universe's creation. Dark matter is thought to underpin the universe's large-scale structures, like the cosmic web of filaments and galaxy clusters. However, understanding its role in the cosmos is challenging. Simulations indicate dark matter provides a gravitational framework for galaxies' formation. Despite decades of research in deep underground experiments or space-based gravity detectors, direct evidence of dark matter continues to elude scientists. The specifics of how dark matter interacts with ordinary matter, influencing galaxy formation and behavior, remain uncertain. Unraveling this relationship is a key question in astrophysics, and as of now, our understanding is based largely on logical assumptions. The quest to identify the true nature of dark matter particles continues, a critical puzzle in our comprehension of the universe. Some researchers propose alternative gravity theories, such as Modified Newtonian Dynamics MOND, or Modified Gravity MG to explain cosmic phenomena traditionally attributed to dark matter. These theories seek to adjust gravitational laws on cosmic scales. However, they're still under scrutiny and face obstacles in accounting for all astronomical observations. Theoretical cosmological models suggest a possible link between dark matter and the multiverse concept, positing our universe as just one among many. The nature of this connection and its broader implications remain active research areas. Here are some intriguing aspects of dark matter that might shock you. 1. It's a cosmic ghost, completely invisible, does not emit, absorb, or reflect anything. This characteristic renders it completely hidden from even our most sophisticated devices and observation methods. 2. Here's a startling fact. Dark matter isn't just a small piece of the cosmic pie. It's estimated to make up about 27% of all the mass and energy in the universe. Now compare that to the mere 5% composed of all the stars, planets, and other forms of matter we can actually see. It's a bit unnerving to realize that the bulk of the universe is made of something we cannot even glimpse. 
3. The plot thickens with theories suggesting that dark matter might be up to more than we know. It could be interacting in ways we haven't yet understood, hinting at potential phenomena that are, for now, entirely hypothetical. The catch? There's no direct evidence for this, yet. 4. Dark matter isn't just a bystander. It's actively shaping the universe's future. Its gravity works against the universe's expansion, but it's a cosmic tug-of-war with an uncertain outcome. Will it result in a grand reversal of the cosmic expansion, a continued icy drift apart, or something else entirely? The debate continues to rage among scientists. This elusive, unseen substance is not just a passive player, but a defining factor in our universe's past, present, and future, making the cosmic narrative all the more compelling and, indeed, a bit unsettling. Lots of new things have been found out about dark matter. One important idea is the dark photon. It's a big deal in studying dark matter these days. This theoretical particle, akin to the photon in electromagnetism, could bridge the known universe with the elusive dark sector. Scientists are keenly investigating its potential through high-energy particle collision experiments, specifically using a process called deep inelastic scattering. This method probes hadrons, revealing subatomic structures and fundamental forces. Current findings from these experiments indicate a strong preference for the existence of dark photons over established physics theories, suggesting we may be on the verge of a significant discovery in understanding the universe's hidden mass. Do you want to hear one interesting fact? While we know a bit about dark matter, our understanding of dark energy is even more limited. Yes, you heard it right. There is something called dark energy. Indeed, it's distinct from dark matter and even more mysterious. Its true nature remains unknown, whether a form of repulsive gravity, a type of fluid, a substance, or something entirely different. Yet it's undeniable that something is propelling the universe's expansion. But what is it precisely? Well, that remains unclear. While several theories offer meaningful insights into dark matter's existence, we are virtually in the dark regarding dark energy. But now, the question might arise that the universe we see today, for example stars, galaxies, and planets, are just 5%, which means the remaining 95% is non-physical? Well, that's not the case. Dark matter interacts via the gravitational force, and it does cause gravitational lensing, which is a physical effect. Hence, we know it is there, but we don't know what it's made of. Similarly, dark energy has a physical presence, driving the universe's expansion. Acting as a sort of anti-gravity force, it's both measurable and physical. Speculation suggests it accounts for approximately 65% to 70% of the universe's total mass energy content. Dark matter is a mysterious part of space, making up a significant part of the universe's weight, but we can't see it. Most ideas say dark matter doesn't really touch or mix much with anything, even itself. But the self-interacting dark matter idea tells a different story, saying it does mix in ways we didn't expect. This idea could help explain why galaxies move in ways that our space models don't get right. Another interesting idea is the sterile neutrino, a tiny thing that barely interacts with regular stuff, making scientists think it might be the main piece of dark matter. Strange X-ray lights found in space make people wonder more, as they might show sterile neutrinos are there. Fuzzy dark matter brings a really new idea, saying dark matter is made of super light particles that move like waves in the big space picture. This thought tries to fix the mismatch between the small galaxy shapes we see and the ones our theories predict. Primordial black holes, thought to have started when the universe was a baby, are different from the usual black holes we think of. Some space theory experts think these ancient things could be what dark matter is. Talking about black holes, some people think dark matter could make hair-like shapes around them, something that, if proven true, would help us really get how the universe works. Gravitational waves, or the space-time shakes, might also have important hints, possibly showing what dark matter is like. What they can tell us is super useful in understanding why galaxies spin in a weird way, something really clear in the Tuller-Fisher observation. Super cool experiments like Xenon-1T are key in this big space search, working in the quietest places on Earth to find dark matter mixing with other stuff. In the same way, 
Places like the Large Hadron Collider are really important, looking at high-speed particle smashes to find signs of dark matter. Also, some people think dark matter might pile up inside neutron stars, changing how they heat up, and maybe even helping black holes start, which makes our space knowledge even more complicated. Really, dark matter is a deep space puzzle, full of mysteries and hard questions. Alternative theories and connections to broader cosmological concepts like multiverses continue to be explored, enhancing the intrigue surrounding this cosmic enigma. What do you think is the true nature of dark matter? Please share your ideas. Thanks for watching.